Monkey 1000 and I have my mother mother yeah I'm your mother okay and what do we have today mom a Timu haul <laughs> that's what you call it a Timu haul good size one what did you buy me ah uh, nothing this time oh you got the hat that was enough no it wasn't well, some of the times you're in the hospital when I do these things. Yeah, I know. Okay, guys. <laughs> we'll be right back. Okay, guys. Sorry. I had a phone call. It was her therapist, so I had to take it. Anyways, guys, we got this haul here. We're going to start, and I'm just going to grab and go. Okay, so we have a little box here. I don't... I think I know what it is. This is probably for, this is for Shea Bear. He doesn't know that I bought him this, um, but he will. <laughs> this is, and it's small. This was $3.56. This is an ashtray. I thought it was cute. And he can, he keeps his ashtray in the garage because he mostly smokes out there. He kind of runs in the house with it if he's going to the front door or something. But most of the time he's in the garage with it. So, because um, I don't like cigarette smoke in my house. And neither does he. So he's he's pretty good with it. Um, you know. Or he goes outside. I don't know what these are for. I have no idea what that's for. I have no idea. So, um... I don't know what this is. It's a screw, I think. Oh, maybe it's like a permanent. Wait, you screw it to the dashboard? No, it's not for a dashboard. It's an ashtray. Let me show, show the picture. This is what it looks like in the video. Of course, they always look bigger than what they really come as. But see, that's it there. Yeah. Oh, the felt goes on the bottom. I don't know why they just didn't stick the felt on the bottom. The, the felt goes on here. And, of course, it gives you that. What is this thing? It's a screw. It has a screw thing in here. Oh, well, you know what? Let me see. Maybe it's for you. you can lay your cigarette on it. I don't know. Doesn't make sense. Anyways, I'm screwing this thing in here. Maybe I might get him to do it because he doesn't know he's getting this yet. But um, anyway, it's not a surprise. It's just I just never tell him when I buy things <laughs> like I don't with her. <laughs> she just gets them unless she says something. If she says something, oh, can you find me this on Timu? And I'll say, okay. And then I like her to know what she likes. So I'll say, oh, you like that one? Yeah, it just screws in there like that. I guess it's for the ashes. You put your cigarette here and it just drops down slowly into the container. Mm. And then it has a little lid on it so he can cover it up. Less smell in the garage. <laughs> you see what I'm getting at? And this goes on the, bottom. on the bottom. So this is just a little sticky thing. And you just take it off. Felt, isn't it? Yeah, it's like a little felt thing. And I get it's probably for more of a coffee table or something like that. So you're not scratching your table. There. It just fits like that. And there you go. Cute. Yeah, it'll get, make them happy. So let me turn this off and I'll get them in here. I got you something. Now you tell me what it is. Okay, I'm going to turn it around, guys, so you guys can see them. There you go. So I got you this. It's a nice tray. Yeah. yeah. So you can put it in the garage and you don't have to use that little tin thing anymore. <laughs> Thank you. And you can put a lid. It has a lid for you, so you can just put the yep. lid on top when you don't use it and it won't spill everywhere. Thank you. Yeah. That'd be nice. 
You like that? Get it cleaned out and use Joe's. Well, you can use both. Yeah. You'll have two. He's got two of those tires. Yeah. Yeah, one of those ashtrays. Yeah, he's got them in the garage too. Yeah. They're on the table. Yeah, they were your dad's. But yeah. the table's so covered. They used to have them <laughs> at park stores because you could smoke. Yeah. When you go yeah. in, you sit on the stool and you sit yeah. and smoke, talk to the guys. All right. But I got two of them. So. All right. So yeah, thank you. I thought it was pretty. I thought it was different. It's cool. I don't yeah. Know about pretty. But. I thought it was pretty. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Okay, guys. All right, we'll turn you around. And I paid, I paid three dollars and fifty-six cents for it. So I thought it was, to me, it was pretty. Don't tell him that it was pretty. <laughs> right now it's four 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 forty-nine. So that's what. It's nice. I like it. Yes, it'd be nice if you even smoke in your home or something, you know. But he doesn't. Thank you, mommy. You're welcome. Well, yeah. Yep. Did you get it right this time? I don't know. What? <laughs> he called me mommy. <laughs> he always does. No, he calls me monkey. He oh. always calls me monkey, not mommy. I'm not his mother. I know you're not. <laughs> All right, so the next thing. Oh, I did get you something. I forgot. Oh. I did get her something. So let me get this going here first. Everybody forgets what they buy. Well, because it takes so long. By the time you get it, you have bought other things or you just forget. I think that's why some people get two of one thing. Mm, sometimes, yeah. So, I got you these. These are a pair of slippers. Oh, do I need new slippers? Well, I like the one pair that you got. And you seem to like them a lot. <laughs> but your feet are always cold. And if I got to throw them in the wash, get yeah. your water if you need your water. If I got to throw them in the wash and, and, you know, we don't get them that day. Yeah. I thought maybe you might like these. These look big, though. I don't know. Hopefully Men, they'll men's fit. Men's size? No, these are women's. You don't need men's. These are really kind of rubbery. These are called Cozy and Warm Winter Plush Slippers. They were $7.27. I got them in blue this time instead of pink. I just thought she'd like a different color. You can try this on. See how it works. I'll put them on her, and I'll, I'll put them on, and and uh, I don't I don't know if she can put them on herself. They're hard for her to put on slippers or any shoe, so they are very thick. I mean, look at the sole on the back. They're supposed to be non-skid, so you could wear these out if you wanted to. It's yeah. boutique on them. I don't know why, but it does. Um, so was it the people that made it? I don't know. I have no idea. And it's a 42 through 43, which is really, I, I think it's a size 9.5 through a 10. Hopefully they're not too big. I don't know. But we'll try these on and I'll show them at the end of the video. So you'll have to tell me if you like them. Okay. The next thing I got here... I don't know what, oh, <laughs> these are for when we go camping. We car camp now. So as you most of you know that we have a tent that goes attaches to the car. Well, sometimes it's hot in that car and we, we want to put the windows down <coughs> in the car. These are screens <coughs> to put over the car windows so you can, you can um, have the breeze come in. <laughs> but the bugs stay up because in the tent I have screen all the way around so we can open that up and then if we have the windows in the car if you want to put them down for breeze while we're sleeping so anyways I'll put these on I'm sorry guys I had to get something to drink um, I'll put these on the windows in the car and we'll see if they fit hopefully they do you're supposed to have two for the front and two for the back windows. Oh. And so hopefully that will work pretty good. Because <clears throat> when we went camping, when we went to the pier, we had to camp in the car. Um, because, you know, we, we first we camped at this little beach that was off the pier because it said no dogs allowed. So we had Bruno with us, so we're like, oh shit, you know, what are we going to do, right? 
<clears throat> so we just we we figure we could fish right there, but the problem is with fishing at where the beach was is that it was all rocks on the side. I cannot cast out far enough to miss these rocks. I'd be all right to get it out, but to bring it in, it gets in the rocks. And and Shea Bear had the same problem, so um, it it became difficult, and we were getting frustrated. So. Um, we ended up going on the pier anyway, so I was like, well, all they can do is tell us no, you know, mm -hmm. right? Because he's really a service animal. So they're not supposed to um, tell us no with a service animal at all in any place. And besides, he was going to stay in the car because you park on the pier, you park in front of where you're, you're fishing. So he would, he would have stayed in the car anyways. So we did that. But the thing was, um, we, had, we slept in the back of the car there, up on the pier. And uh, we had the windows down, but it would have been nice to have just the screen on so then the flies and the bugs wouldn't get in there. Yeah, they're terrible. <clears throat> especially the further you go south, the worse they get in Florida. So, especially at this time of year in the summer and that. So hopefully this will work out. I don't know if I told you it was $4.78 for these. So hopefully I will show you at the end of this video so you guys can see them on the car. So, okay, my next thing is my grandbaby Zoe. Her birthday's in July. So I, I'm starting to slowly buy a few things here and there for her. So I found this cute little hat. I'm not going to take it out because it is a present um, for her. And I'll show you the picture so you guys can see. It was $5.48 for her. And this is what it looks like in the video. They have all different colors. I got her pink, of course. It's a light pink. So they have darker pink and all kinds. Of, they have all kinds of colors. All kinds. But they have the little chin thing underneath. So then... Um, you know, if it's windy or something, that they, they, it won't fall off their mm -hmm. heads. See? Yeah. You like that? Yeah. That's what that looks like. Yeah. Cute. So it's three dollars and nine cents. And um, yeah, so I got her that. And my other grandbaby, his birthday's in June, so I got him a hat, and it's got Spider-Man on it. So, let me see if I can take it out because it's got that label on there. So, um, yeah. I, I'm going to put his stuff in a... I put it all in a box, so I'll straighten it out so you guys can see it a little bit better. There you go. Isn't that cute? So, I got him a little hat. I found him some sunglasses for... Um, at, um, Walmart, so I, I thought, oh, I'll get him one of these hats. And it's adjustable in the back, right here. Cute. Very nice. Nice hat. Cute? Yeah. Nicholas will like that. Yeah. So, I got him that for his birthday. And that was um, a, a, a 48 right now. Let me see how much I pay for it. Um, I paid eight forty eight for it. But it's nice. It's a nice little hat. Very nice quality. Cute, huh? Yeah, I really like it. Yeah, I do too. So I got him that for his birthday. I'll put that back in there so you guys don't have to listen to all that crinkling. And um, what else I got in here? Okay, I got, oh, I don't know if you remember, I bought some placemats. I will have to show them to you. But I got, I'll put this on my table and I'll take a picture of it when it comes out. I got the runner for it. It looks exactly the same as the placemat. <laughs> so I got the runner to go down the middle of the table. What do you think? I love it. Isn't that nice? Oh, it's nice. Gorgeous quality. Qual <laughs> quality. <laughs> Drink your water. She starts coughing. I start coughing. <laughs> it's like a, 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 a catchy thing. It's like somebody yawns, the other person yawns. So I paid paid $5.93 for that. 
and I'm going to put that on my table. I might buy me another one and put it down the coffee table <coughs> if I, you know. I really like it. Isn't it nice? <coughs> Is it knitted or tape? I don't know. <coughs> I have no idea. I don't know. Um, it doesn't have anything on it, so it doesn't really say. It is handmade, it says. It's a long ho boho table runner. That's what they call it. Let me see if I can get it on the, on the picture here so I can. Table runner for home decor, farmhouse, ru rustic table runner, cream and brown. Uh, I like the macar macar what do they call that? Macarame? Macarame. Macarame? Yeah, that's what they call this, macarame. So, I like it. It's very nice. Mm -hmm. oh, I like that. See, when you brought out the placemats, I like those too. Yeah, and see, I, I thought, oh, they have the runner that goes with it, so I thought that would look nice. Oh, yeah. That would look pretty. And then I thought, well, I might get one to put down my coffee table right here. Yeah. That, that would look nice there too. Yeah. So, either way. I can do it. So I'll show it to you at the end of the video so you guys can get the idea. Um, I think that's it, guys. So that's all I got on this haul. Pretty good, huh? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Now, before you place your next haul, talk to me because I got a few things I want. I just placed one five minutes ago. Oh. <laughs> you should tell me these things. Because I have things I need. Oh well, okay. We'll 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 go over them, and the next time I'll put them in my basket, and then the next time I buy it, we'll we'll have it. Okay. okay. All right. All right, guys. That's it for now. The monkey says she's out. I hope you enjoyed the haul. And sorry about the coughing. I know some people don't like it. Well, sometimes you just can't help it, and that's just life. So um, yeah. So what do you think? I like the haul. I yeah, like the things you got. And I'm going to show you guys all this stuff at the end. I'm going to put the shoes on and show you right now. So I'll stay tuned for, for the ending part. But Monkey says she's out for now. Bye, y'all. Bye, y'all. <laughs> okay, guys. There's her shoes. Um, well, I'll have to see how well she walks in them. Um, yeah, we'll see. We'll have to see. They feel comfortable. Do they? Do they? Nice and fluffy, and they're warm, really nice and warm. Because your feet are always cold, so I thought they would be nice, especially in the winter time. Yeah. You know, because this tile's cold. She has to have something on her feet. Yeah. Okay, guys. Okay, guys, so this is the runner. These are my placemats that I bought in my one haul that if you had seen. Um, and I think they, they are pretty close. Um, they match really good. You know, it, I mean, we have the leaf in this. We can take the leaf out. Um, but I was like, why? Why Why take it out, you know? Um, we got plenty of room here, so we just leave it in. It is on the, each side. So if you have a longer table than this, it might be too short. But, um, yeah. So, but I like it. I think I'm happy with it. I'd like to get two more placemats for my um, bar over here. And then I'd like to get one more runner for my coffee table. And then it would all match together. I think that'll look cute. So there you go. Okay, guys, we're outside. I got Shea Bear with me. Maybe. Anyway. <laughs> Anyways, he's here. We put the two on here in the front. And he's going to show you how to do the back one. So it's very simple. They are very, very fine. I do have the windows down here. It's very fine. <laughs> so you would have to be very careful with these so they do not rip. They do go over the mirror here. I think you can see my hand here. And they go over the mirror on the front ones. And both of them are on the front. So I have the window down. See, you can see the mesh. And he's going to show you how to do the back ones. They're a little bit different, but not too hard, I don't think. No. So. Just in case you guys are interested in these, um, but you're going to have to be very careful with them. 
Uh, very fine. Yeah, yeah, yep. Yeah, it probably wouldn't take too much to rip them. No. Not at all. No. These tag ends here. Let's see the tag ends. Velcro sticks. Uh huh. You can unpeel this. Uh huh. You stick it like, I'll show you on over here. Okay. It'll be a little easier. Mm hmm. Now, this was just for SUVs, so yeah. it didn't. So, like, you can stick one there, and that'll Velcro it down. Yep, speak up. Is Quite it working? Thin. Yes, it's working. Oh, I couldn't see the light. So it doesn't have a light. This you peel the back off of this, and you can stick it right there, or wherever, and that helps hold that down. So that's what these are for. Mm-hmm. Well, and there's one on each side. Right. One over in here. On that side too, yeah. Which you can stick on to the door, and then, of course, these will just stay on there. And then, whenever you want to put these on, you just and the, they and velcro keep them tight. Yeah, velcro. Well, we were thinking, you know, when we go camping in the car, and we need some air, especially at this time of year, we need the air yeah. in the car. And you know, we'll also have our camp, our, camp, our tent in the back. And it's got airflow, so we should be okay. Give you uh, four of these, so. Yeah, two for each window. Yeah, two for each window. Yeah. But if you wanted to get more, you can buy these things. At right. Much anywhere. You stick on there if you wanted and help hold that down. Uh huh. You know, or on the inside, you can stick it there. Yeah. On your door. Yeah, that'd probably be better. Help hold it down. Yeah. But, so the bugs don't get in. I mean, you know, I don't think there'd be a problem with bugs getting in there. Right. But if it was me, I would put them on the outside. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, there you go. Yeah, so so those, what do you think of them? That, they'll help. Yeah, I think they'll help a lot. Because we get a lot of bugs down here in Florida. Yeah. And when we were camping in the car... You know, we wanted to put the windows down, but then you have all these mosquitoes that were trying to come in. So we were like hot. <laughs> you want to get mosquitoes in your tent, in your car, regardless, because you want to go in and out. Right. It's like you do in a tent. You unzip a tent, you go out and zip it back up, 30 mosquitoes are in there. Right, right. That fast. So same way here. You open this up, and you get out or get something out, close it, there's a damn mosquito in there. But this will help. Yeah, it will help. Because, you know, I mean, we would, they don't usually bother her, but they bother me. So, they don't, um, so like, when we was on the bridge. Yeah. When we was fishing on the bridge in Tampa. Yeah. Was it Tampa? Yeah, it was Tampa. Okay, so, we was on the bridge there. It wasn't too bad because it was windy up on that bridge. Yeah, we but were lucky. Like, if we were sitting here, mm -hmm. like, in this yard or. Out by the river, you mm -hmm. know, we couldn't have the windows down if we just wanted to camp in this, like we sometimes do. Mm -hmm. We camp in the back of this, we can't have the windows down. Right, and it makes it very hot. Can't. And so, if we have the windows up, it's really hot, even with a fan, because there's no air moving. It's just moving the hot air around. Right. So, this way, it'll keep 99% of the bugs away. We can put one of our cells up here mm -hmm. on top, one on each side, maybe even. Mm -hmm. That'll help keep the bugs away from us. Yeah. So, away from the car. Right. So, I think these will help out a lot. He's talking about the bug cells that we have. Yeah, the mosquito yeah. cells. Right. Thermocells. The yeah. thermocells. The yeah. thermocells. Yeah. But, now, did you do your research on this? No, I... Because I was told... I don't know why I'm speaking up here at the camera real loud because your mic's over here. But, I was told by somebody one night that was eating munchies in the tent when we was in bear territory that I said, look, man, you know, why don't you just eat them in the truck? 
She said, no, I've seen YouTube videos. They could open them truck doors, but they can't unzip a tent. And I said, hun, it's a bear. They have claws. They don't need to unzip this tent. And she went, oh. <laughs> she was thinking they would have had to unzip the tent, and they can't because, you know, they don't have the thumbs. So hopefully these are bear proof. And then, I don't know about that. And then when we get deer spray. Yeah. That's another story. She wants to get deer spray sometime. But there you go. He won't let me love these things now. No, I will not. <laughs> there you go, Monk. Yeah, those are pretty good. Pretty good idea, Monk. Not bad, huh? That's so, yes, a pretty good idea. There you go, guys. And uh, we'll see you in the next video. And they are kind of dark. Yeah, they are. So. Yeah. So. It'll help keep the sun. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, even if you have kids, you know, you want to put the window down, but you don't want them to, to throw things out. You got, you could get these Yep. and that kind of protects it a little bit. I don't know how much, but it would protect it if they were trying to throw out a bottle or, or oh, teether or something well, like my that. Kids never did that but my they son could drop did. Something, you know. Well, my son threw his milk bottle out the door, at the, at the door out the window when we were driving and that was the last time he ever had a bottle <laughs> yeah, you're old enough to do that well i guess you don't want it son that's right but you know sometimes they play with stuff and it'll fly out yeah yeah this will help keep that from happening right but i you know i don't know what it, what they're like going down the road 70 miles an hour i don't know but mostly for camping for us it'll be, i think it'll work good for us great idea we just kind of have to be careful putting them on and off because yeah, they are very they're, fine they're thin. Yeah. But still, I mean, it lets a lot of air in there. They yeah. go up into nothing. Yeah. You put them in a little bag, you put them in our stuff. Yeah. Well, I actually put them in a cubby hole back here or something. Yeah. And there you go. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I know about that. We're not going to talk about it. What happened? Really? That was going in the backyard. The palm tree got a hold of it. And it went. <laughs> I'm going in. And I was hoping you wouldn't have seen it. Yeah, I saw it. So, yeah, he, he's one of these people that you can't pass anything by him. I put mm -mm. the first scratches on the truck, though. I admit that. Yeah, well. Right I, after we got it. And you said, well, that's what we got it for. So I think I did the longest one. She's right. That's what we got it for. And but I think it can be buffed out, hopefully. But. Anyways, guys, that's it It'll for now. Out. If not, it's all right. Yeah. It's fine. So that's it for now, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Sorry about your my mother's coughing. And then I had to turn mine off because I started coughing. It was one of those addiction things. Addiction? So, yeah. You know, one sneezes, the other one sneezes. Yeah. Addiction. Huh? Yeah. Addiction. So anyways, guys, I'll catch you in the next one. Take care and enjoy. Bye.